Hello and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to show you how you can easily clip footage with NVIDIA's GeForce Experience. Now what clipping actually means is basically just recording in the past. So let's just say you were playing a game of Call of Duty for example and you were playing a game but you weren't recording and you managed to get a really cool clip that you actually wanted to record and save so you could show your friends or something like that. The way to do that would actually be to clip it. So you can basically just clip the clip and it records the past five minutes which has already been played already. So the first step to being able to do this is basically having this GeForce experience downloaded. And once you have it, you just want to open it up and in the top right corner, you will see your name. And next to that, you'll see a cog, which will lead you to the settings. And then when you come down a little bit, you'll see this bit here, in-game overlay. Now, you want to make sure yours is set on like mine is here. And you also want to take note of what keybind is to set it up. Mine is Alt-Z for this example. So once you have your hotkey memorized, what you want to do is just jump into a game. So I'm not going to play a game now just for the sake of the video, but let's just say I was playing a game and I was running around with a sniper and I got a really good kill that I wanted to save and show my friends. The way to do it would basically be click Alt Z or whatever keybind you have set and then you just want to look for this instant replay. Now when you click on this it gives you the option to turn it on but it also gives you the options for settings. So what we can do is we can click on settings first and up here is what's most important, instant replay length. So this basically record how long it records in the future. So if you clipped a game, but your game was 10 minutes long, you might want to set this to 10. If it's longer, 20 for example, 20 is the most you can do. But if you only need 5 minutes, you can go ahead and just keep on 5 minutes. And what's also cool about this is depending on what quality you have, it will depend on how big the file size is, and it actually shows you here. So if you know that you don't have much space, you can, you can adjust that so it suits you the best. So once you've got your instant replay length and your quality set, you can also set the resolution, frame rate and bit rate if you wanted to. But if you're happy with these settings, we can go ahead and click save. Now, if we were in a game, we could just click Alt Z to bring this menu up. But the good thing about this is there's a hotkey, which is Alt Shift F10. So we can be in a game and then whenever we get that clip that we want to record, we can just hit that hotkey and it will record in the past for us, which is a really cool feature and it can be really useful to be honest. So I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please comment down below and like and subscribe for more. Thank you for watching.